Welcome back to our channel. In our previous videos, we discussed the preparation and procedure for a hair transplant. Today, we want to address an important aspect often overlooked, the challenges and considerations after a hair transplant. So, let's dive into what happens after the procedure. Reality Check Shedding and Shock Loss After a Hair Transplant, It's Common to Experience Shedding and Shock Loss Shedding refers to the temporary loss of the transplanted hair, which may occur within a few weeks after the procedure. This can be alarming for some individuals as it may seem like the transplant is failing. However, shedding is a natural part of the hair growth cycle and signifies that the follicles are transitioning into the resting phase before regrowth begins. Shock loss, on the other hand, refers to the temporary loss of existing native hair surrounding the transplant area. This can happen due to the trauma of the procedure, and it usually occurs within the first few weeks as well. It's essential to understand that both shedding and shock loss are temporary and part of the healing process. Post-transplant care and maintenance After the hair transplant, you will receive specific post-transplant care instructions from your hair transplant specialist. It's crucial to follow these instructions diligently to ensure the success and longevity of your hair transplant. This may include gentle washing techniques, avoiding excessive sun exposure, refraining from scratching or picking at the transplant area, and adhering to any prescribed medications or solutions. Maintaining a clean and hygienic scalp is essential during the healing process. However, it's important to note that the transplanted hair will initially have a different texture and appearance than your natural hair. It may be thinner or coarser at first, but it will gradually improve as the hair follicles settle and new growth occurs. Scarring and healing While hair transplant techniques have advanced significantly, scarring is still a possible outcome. The extent and visibility of the scar will depend on the chosen transplantation method and your individual healing process. Follicular unit extraction FUE, techniques usually result in tiny, less noticeable scars, while follicular unit transplantation FUT, may leave a linear scar along the donor area. It's important to discuss scar management options with your hair transplant specialist. They may recommend treatments such as scar creams, laser therapy, or microneedling to minimize the appearance of scars. However, it's essential to have realistic expectations as complete scar elimination is typically not possible. Following a hair transplant, it's common to experience some discomfort and swelling in the scalp area. This discomfort may range from mild soreness to a feeling of tightness or numbness. Swelling can occur due to the trauma of the procedure and typically subsides within a few days or weeks. To manage discomfort and swelling, your hair transplant specialist may recommend pain medication, anti-inflammatory medications, or cold compresses. However, it's important to communicate any severe or prolonged discomfort to your specialist, as it could be a sign of complications. While a hair transplant can significantly boost self-confidence and improve one's appearance, it's essential to acknowledge the psychological impact and manage expectations. It takes time for the transplanted hair to grow and achieve the desired results. Patience is key during this process, as it can take several months to a year for the full outcome to be visible. It's normal to experience a range of emotions during this waiting period. Some individuals may feel anxious, frustrated, or even depressed. It's important to maintain realistic expectations, communicate your concerns with your hair transplant specialist, and seek support from loved ones or professionals to help navigate any emotional challenges. Remember, the journey after a hair transplant is not all smooth sailing. Shedding, shock loss, post-transplant care, scarring, discomfort, and psychological impact are all factors to consider. However, with proper care, patience, and realistic expectations, you can achieve the beautiful, natural-looking hair you desire. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who may benefit from this information. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative videos. Thank you for watching and we wish you the best on your post-transplant journey.